Hey guys, welcome back to Build a Boat. Today we have a new tank, two, two more tanks. One I did a video on, but never got uploaded. One I did a video on. And then my favorite, my new favorite, well actually I don't know, these two are pretty much matched. The M1 Abrams tank. Now this army will grow and more videos will come out of it. So what, what I would like to do is shout out my friend for helping me on the turret. He told me to slant them. Uh, Alan underscore three, seven, seven, four, one. A good friend he is. So, uh, I have a lot of tanks that I want to build like the MTLS one G 14 or the M three Lee grant or the M four Sherman or the M four a six T 26 E four super Pearson. M26 Pearson. There's a lot of tanks I want to build. Like M2, M2, no, M22 uh, Locust, uh, M4 Chaffee, M3 Stewart, M5 Stewart, CTLS 4TA, Merrimum Harrington, CTMS 1TB1, maybe. That's an ugly tank, so probably not that. But uh, some tank destroyers I would like to build. Uh, this is kind of like one. It doesn't really have a turret. Tank destroyers are hurt huge, like the Hurts maybe. But there is a E77 uh, mechanized flamethrower tank, which is pretty cool. A uh, light tank, light tank destroyer. I would say a M3A1 Satan, Sherman Crocodile. That's one. Uh, Hertz is one. I just listed that off one. So, as you can see, I have a small plot, but a lot of tanks that I want to build. And, to be honest, we should have bigger plots, because if I... Like, seriously, I just want a bigger plot. I can have so many tanks. I can fit, like, the M4A3 E2 Jumbo. Or, I don't know. There's just a lot of tanks that I want to build. I already built the tank, the tonk, by the way, which is based off the M, M two A three E two Sherman. I think I got that name wrong, but uh, yeah. I feel like I'm a tank nerd. I've been playing a lot of War Thunder lately. I'm sorry. I will shut up about the tanks and I will get on to the Abrams. So this is the M one Sherman. Uh. Everyone knows about this. This is a tank that you would never want to battle on the battlefield because of how badass it is. So, slanted armor. Normally, this is a bit slanted on the corners, but that's just unnecessary work for me to not do. Uh, let's just go over the small details. We have these boxes, and you're probably wondering what that is. But uh, let's say a missile comes and shoots at you. These things will explode out right before the missile hits, and it will blow up the missile. I think that's how it works. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, there should be mud flaps here, but I accident I, I just put these three little things there. I don't know why. Uh, more sandbags. You see that a lot on the LAV. Uh, I put a lot of sandbags there. There. Uh, these are just machine guns, not hull mounted. Well, this one's pretty much mounted, but uh, I should put like a little seat here and make it turn. But this one turns with the turret, or away from the turret, and is not fixed. Uh, we have plating here, I guess, for armor. A lot of details that I just made up. Antennas for radio and communications. A, a gun ammo box and a health kit. The exhaust thing, or the fan... What The thing for the, the grill, yes. Uh, some storage compartments, also storage compartments. Uh, we have a small little one and another on here, maybe? No. Uh, we have some lights, uh, another armor plating. This one, this is an Abrams I wanted to make feel, like, modified. Like, it's been used a lot for the people, so... Oops, uh, I'm not sure what you're doing, Abrams. Like, people over the years of using one tank modified it, kind of feel. I should probably put, like, little helmets. That would look cool. But uh, if you guys don't know what the Abrams is somehow, this is 
This is used by the army, uh, not the marines, but the army today, like today, today. So it's the modern tank. This uh, this could probably go up against uh, other modern tanks and win, but judging by today's technology, I don't know. Uh, and if you noticed, uh, these tracks are not really tracks. I thinned this one out to not touch the wheels and let the wheels touch the ground. It's to look like a track, but it's really just not a track. I, I don't know. On the L333, the Italian small tank, you can see that I did a full track with little buttons. Now, I'll, I'll drive this one first, because this one's pretty lame. I should probably key bind the motor a little bit differently. Because to turn, you just do A and B, but it's not the, the motor that's doing the turning. It's the jet seat. But as you can see, the little motor pops out. So if I key bind that to make the turning for the motor key, like any key besides D and A, D and a uh, I feel like it would work. As you can see, this gun is fixed. Well, not really. It can turn. It can like aim a little bit, but it can't turn like a turret. So uh, let's go in the Abrams, because this is honestly a cool tank. So the controls for this, if you ever find me on Build-A-Boat and want to drive this, uh, E, uh, Q, W, A, or S, I mean, uh, A and D do all that. R and T are for the turret, and then for the gun on top, it's, uh, well... F, no, not F, G and H, because that feels more natural. Yeah, I would say that feels more natural. So, uh, I don't know what to do in this video. It's just me driving the Abrams, I guess. Uh, there's not much to these uh, build review things. Let's knock this guy out of existence. Can we? Whoa. Is that always there, or did I just make a copy of his build? I don't know. The durability is the, of this thing is okay. I took this thing through the through the uh, course or the stages, however you would like to call it, and it did not do well. It did not survive till uh, before the rocks. So, uh, yeah, let's actually track this guy. See, yeah, our turret is a bit fast. In real life, I feel like the turret would be a little bit faster. Uh, I don't know. Ooh, wait, I have a brilliant idea. I don't feel like we have enough depression. Do we have enough depression? He's just out of reach, come on. No, well, it doesn't matter. The off-roading capabilities of this thing is not good at all. On the, well, in Build-A-Boat, my version is horrible at off-roading because you probably know why uh i'm not sure about the real life version of this probably the torque is a lot better it can go up giant hills better wow that's a thick build it looks weird though it's just a box i saw the oh we lost something oh my gosh yeah this is what i'm talking about it's basically plastic but it's metal the What's the strength for metal? I think it's three. Four. I guess strength four sucks. Yeah, look at that. That armor plating that I added does nothing. Well, uh, I guess this is the end of the video. Uh, this is the M1 Abrams and the LAV and the three, or, I mean, L333. American, American, Italian. Uh, I will work on more tanks in the future, like the M6A2E1 or the M4A2 uh, flyle tank. Uh, yeah, flyle tank. But, uh, yeah, there's a lot of tanks I will build, so I will build a lot here, and I'm going to do a lot of duping, duplicating. So I'll have rows of tanks, and I'll probably build decks above and put tanks there, but... Honestly, I don't know. 
I'll probably make the decks transparent, and it's just a whole block of tanks. What do you think I should build in the comments? Please make it a tank, because I love tanks. Uh, ships will do fine. I'm making a giant Yamato, which I was going to do a part series on, but uh, I, don't, I don't know. This is the giant uh, Yamato, by the way. It's very pointy at the top, but I will fix that in the future. Uh, come on. Let me through the portal. Yeah. So, giant Yamato. This is bigger than my other one. Uh, it can fit two of my other Yamatos in it. See, see what I mean? It's pointy. It should be, like, there. Like, I, I don't know how to fix it. And I'll do it later. But, uh, yeah, this is not the M1 Abrams. Sorry. Got off topic. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe to my main channel. Uh, my reaction should be in the description, but I can also, you can also look it up in my channel's list. Also, subscribe to the build a -Boat nuclear program. Uh, that is where we just blow up servers with nukes and test weapons. So, uh, yeah, go sub to that. I will also be making a Discord pretty soon about build a -Boat weapons and military things, so... You know, you can put your tank builds in there or, some, or something. I don't know. Just thank you guys so much for watching. This is, I already said that three times or something. Or something. Help. English is getting worse. Shana mio mix jitsi fuel oda aba ekwaden Uh, Yeah, just do that. Subscribe.